Sometimes you say, I save the worst for last and I get the worst for beginning. <laughs> I hate to go full power first round. <laughs> hey, how's it going everybody? Welcome back to the Who's Number One vlog. If you haven't heard already, Jacob Couch was originally scheduled to have a match with Nikki Ryan. Nikki Ryan had to pull out because of a knee injury. If you haven't watched our latest vlog, go watch it. We explain it a little bit more, but we're here at Roca to check in on Gordon. This is Gordon's first official match back since his stomach issues. Ultimately, his first match back on his road to ADCC. Let's go see how he's been training. We approach to a distance where we can make contact with him, but he can't make contact with us. Immediately we get his ankles facing out to the side. He's now got a frame on my shoulders and try and hold us off. Our whole thing from here is a simple grip switch. We'll bring our hands from the initial hands on ankles and go in just like so. Head down, tail up and now we're starting to run our opponent's legs around the corner. As we make that run, we're running away from our training partner's frames and putting his knee underneath our armpit. That's always what we're looking to do. From here we go over the top with our elbow as he tries to shrimp away and put us back in guard. It's going to be hard for him to do so. Now a partial sit out means we can ride over our training partner's hips. So when Placido goes to elbow escape, bring the knee in. It's very, very difficult. We don't make the mistake of sitting through. We can be taken backwards. We make sure we're riding on the hip just like so. Hand goes inside our training partner's bicep, gives us an anchor point to pull ourselves up to our training partner's chest and go into our pen. I was actually looking forward to that match between Nikki and, and uh, Mr. Couch. I thought that would have been an awesome match in and of itself. Um, but Nikki had some knee problems last minute, so uh, they asked if Gordon would be interested. He, you know, Gordon, there's always a 90% chance if you offer him a match, he'll take it. Um, it's an exciting, uh, uh, precisely because I think it's such an uh, underdog kind of match. It, it, it's got all those interesting things. Of, it's last minute, it's underdog, it's got two truly interesting characters involved. Um, both of them are very talented, but in very different part, uh, paths in their career. Uh, one's more established, one's more trying to come up. So um, uh, it should be very interesting. What, what would be your thoughts on Jacob Couch and his career so far? Mentally, very, very yes. tough. Every time he comes out, he's not afraid of anyone. He comes out, fights without fear. He's got good, solid developing technique. Um, so much of what counts in competition is your mindset, and uh, his, I think that's his strongest asset. He's, he's, uh, I, I've never seen him be intimidated by any of his opponents. He's, every match he comes out, he's the underdog. He has a very good winning record, beat people that everyone said he had no chance against, and, uh, uh, and of course he's looking to cement that with Gordon Ryan, which would be a, the biggest achievement of his career. switching feint, where I, instead of moving out to his left, I just step left like so, and then from here, I switch, and I pass the opposite side. So I go in, left leg first, he thinks I'm gonna pass left, I switch, and I throw right leg, and now we're past the J point on the right side. Now from here, he goes to bring the knees in, we pass the far shoulder, you have to keep those knees and elbows connected, we walk, 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 and from here, we come in, and fight our upper body position, however it may be. Sometimes you say, I save the worst for last, and I get the worst for beginning. <laughs> I hate to go full power first round. <laughs> <laughs> It's like uh, wrestling with a gorilla. It's, uh, it's unbelievable. I mean, I, I, I've seen his evolution through the years. Just 
he's the best one. I, he's the best man I ever ever rolled with. Like hands down. Like I never felt anybody with that level of, of technicality and strength and, and execution is just apart from everything else. I've seen. Uh, these guys here are the best rappers in the world. Like have a chance to, to go with them, and it's an experience that I that not a lot of people can can have. You know? I wasn't planning to compete. I actually have a follow-up with my doctor. I have to do a retest uh, either this week or next week to see how my stomach's actually doing. And then uh, late April, I do another round of treatment and then late April, I have another follow-up with my doctor. And uh, I wasn't planning to compete until I consulted with him and we actually looked at the test results after that. Um, and then after that, I was planning to come back. Uh, but I've been feeling better, probably about 45, 50% better, um, which is a tangible improvement over how I was. Um, and I saw that, you know, Nikki got hurt. You actually messaged me and you were like, hey, do you want to fight Jacob Couch, like last minute? And I was like, yeah, sure, I guess so. <laughs> like, this is like a good, you know, a good time to, to come back and get my feet wet and get back in the competition. Because um, I do want to compete as much as I can before ADCC, but I wasn't healthy enough to do it. Uh, so this is a good way to get, get back in the competition scene and then hopefully announce my f officially that I'm coming back after we do this next follow-up appointment. So I'm a big fan of him and the Daisy Fresh guys. Uh, and as far as the competitor, I mean, he's a guy who goes out and he, he beats people he's not supposed to. Um, he, had that, he had that highlight reel match with Roberto where he heel hooked Roberto and you know, finished him with a dev devastating heel hook. Um, and he's been beating some top guys uh, recently. Um, he's not a guy who's perceived as you know, a world beater yet, um, but he's a guy who's working up through the ranks and he's beating a lot of top guys. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.